Hi, I'm Ari and I'm a product manager here at Chad. Today, I'm happy to give you a tour of our brand new release, Shadow PC for Raspberry Pi. Here at Shadow, we strive to bring the power of high-end technology on any device. This is why we're expanding on more and more platforms. So after months of development, we're thrilled to add Raspberry Pi to the Shadow ecosystem. We adapted our unified client to ARM64 to deliver the same Shadow experience that you already know. With its small size, multiple IOs and low cost, Raspberry Pi is the perfect solution to create a compact desktop experience or even enjoy your computer on a TV screen. First, let's review what you'll need to get started. The Shadow app is supported on any model of Raspberry Pi 4, including the Pi 400. You'll also need to run Raspberry Pi OS in its 64-bit version. For further information about flashing your SD card, please check our Help Center article. And as always, we recommend an Ethernet connection to enjoy our service at its best. All right, let's get into it. The first step is to download the .deb package, which you can find on our website or with the link in the description. Opening the .deb package will automatically install the APT repository and signing key to enable updates through the system's package manager. Step two is to right-click on the .deb file, click on package install, and follow the instructions to complete the install. And the final step, open the Shadow app. You'll find Shadow from the Raspberry menu on the top left corner, in the sound and video section. By the way, if you want to do all these through command lines, the procedure is available on our Help Center. So there it is, the Shadow PC launcher running natively on Raspberry Pi. As you can see, the app looks exactly the same as the existing desktop apps. You'll find the latest news here, the settings section there, and of course, the start button to launch your Shadow PC. You'll also find the same quick menu accessible by clicking the button on the top of the screen. Shadow PC will of course support your keyboard, mouse, and gamepads. For the best experience on Raspberry, we recommend using a 1080p resolution and a refresh rate of 60Hz. All right, let's give it a try. This was an overview of Shadow PC on Raspberry Pi. We're very happy to add this to the growing Shadow ecosystem and we can't wait to see what you'll do with it. Thanks for joining in and as always, send us your feedback on Discord. See you on Shadow.